Does anybody know what's really going on in this world? I was in live stream earlier and I just watched these trolls just trolling, trying to trigger somebody. And it's just like, do y'all even know the real severity of the globe of what we're dealing with? That I have so much stuff I want to say and do on this platform, but it would all be taken away if I told y'all the real truth. If y'all knew the real truth about what goes on in this world and what I have to face in my life. I mean, just my own testimony by itself, my own... I know, I, I know how my, my story ends. I had to pray, even talking about praying for somebody, YouTube's talking about striking video. It has become abhorrent, and I hate it, and we keep getting these warnings, and you keep getting closer to these warnings, closer to these warnings, closer, and we don't have much time left. We don't. Everyday Christian, we don't have time left. We don't have, if y'all see the signs, have y'all not seen this young lady in Afghanistan begging a soldier for help because of what her life will be without, if she doesn't get out of there? Y'all know there's Americans over there that can't get, still have not made it out, that are trying to get to the airport. And there's a young Afghani lady asked, begging a soldier for help. Because she knew when she was left in that country what would happen and, and it just I I had to pray for it because just the thought of it and the, and the look in her eyes and the look on her face that she was, have y'all seen this video? Have y'all seen New Zealand has shut down over one case? Over one New Zealand has shut down. Have y'all seen Australia, 24,000 miners in a stadium. Have y'all seen that? Y'all know what this globe is coming to. Y'all see what's going on with Taiwan. Y'all see the propaganda. They talk about this person that's in the White House that supposedly... Do y'all do y'all not see this all that's coming to play in this world? But y'all sit here and troll and hate on each other. Do y'all see what this world is coming to? That a man not might not buy, sell, trade without the mark of the beast. Do y'all not see? Who hath an ear? Let him hear. We've been warned by people such as William Cooper for years, since the 80s, since the 90s. We've been being told what's coming to happen. We've been told how much this has pushed. They've said it right in front of our face. Go watch that old show with Jesse Ventura that was on True TV. Go watch that. They say it right there. It is all coming to fruition. And they keep ramming it down our throats and nobody does nothing about it. We just sit here. I get so mad and angry because I can't. I can't tell the truth. I can't sit here and, and talk about what's really going on in the globe. I can't do it even though I see it. And I have so much evidence of things that I can't ever put it out. You would be horrified by some of the things I've seen and some of the things I know. Where this world is going to. What really is going on in Afghanistan? What is happening? What? Why is that a key move? Why is that mirroring Saigon 1975? Why? Or was it 1971? I'm sorry if I had the date wrong. If you don't see a little girl begging a Marine for help, it doesn't affect you. Something is wrong. We're going to sit here and hate on each other and troll everybody in this world. But you see things like that out in this world, you don't want to see. You don't want to look at it. You don't want to face the truth. Go watch.
watch the video and see. Go watch it. If that doesn't affect you, it was coming to this world in the spiritual battle. If you do not see it, I wrote the book after September 11th about the Harbinger. And now we're getting echoes through time. 20 perfect years later. Go watch the video of the girl at the rail. Go watch it. She's begging that Marine now for 